people I'm official rock the Bible it belong to us not even a fuss I tell you awesome script we know for sure praise it how we're fluently that great man that's a major hit stay up in the strip hey like, what's a nigger anyway the definition is a ticket so we going back to fall at 13 and 1 man we know and it's a business talk about our history you play with that you play with me do the run of me 28 and 60 at that made me Judea? Yes. Yeah. Oh, they did. They yeah. did, for a fact. Hey, okay. That's why it's called Judea. Right. I'm glad you said that. Yeah, bro. It's all good. It's all good. So, so you know about now, Acts too, yeah. right? Now watch this. Yeah, I'm learning. Now watch this, brother. So, today, today we're showing you that everybody outside the nation of Israel yeah. are the Gentiles. Okay? And we're about to show you something in the Bible. Do you remember when the Israelites went off? Uh, what? When they didn't serve the, uh, when they weren't serving the Most High God and they was breaking his laws? When they start sinning. When they right. start sinning, brother. That's when they became Gentiles. They start following after other nations. Right. They weren't following after God. Right. If you have children and your children following somebody else's daddy, but he said, you're going to be like, man, all right, go on head over here with him then. Right. I ain't told you time after time again to listen to me, right. but you want to go out there and bait them. Right. That ain't your daddy. Right. That's how God did. We kept obeying the other nation. He said, man, all right, go on ahead and go ahead and worship some other guys. That's right. That's when they became Gentiles. We're about to show you. Read on. That's right. The book of Ephesians, chapter 2, and verse 11. Grab the book of Ephesians. Yeah, I got it. Book of Ephesians. Go to Colossians, chapter 1. Uh, 1 uh, 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 Corinthians. Oh, first, oh 12, 1 Corinthians 12. Start at verse 10. 1 Corinthians, what? No, no, go to no. Ephesians. Ephesians. Go to Ephesians. Oh, Ephesians? Fine. Ephesians, what? Chapter 2, verse 11. Chapter, Ephesians, let me go. Ephesians. Fine. Chapter there you two. go. Chapter two. Let me see what let me study your Bible now. What book is the version you got? You got the green Bible. Chapter two. You got, I ain't never seen green letter. Right. Green letter. Let's go to eleven. Eleven. We're gonna talk about these Gentiles. So then, Ephesians chapter two, verse eleven. Wherefore remember that ye being in times past Gentiles in the flesh. So how you be a Gentile in the flesh? We're about to show you. Read on. Let me hear it. Who are called uncircumcision by that which is called the circumcision in the flesh made by hands. That at that time ye were without Christ, being aliens from the commonwealth of Israel. So they've been without Christ, and they were aliens from the commonwealth of Israel. They, they became Gentiles. They wasn't following the Israelite customs no more. You see that? Right, read, on. Keep keep read on. And strangers from the covenants. Of uh oh, you talk about that covenant again, right? Strangers from the covenant of the promise, which the Israelites got. The Israelites, the ones that got the covenant, not the world, brother. And strangers from the covenants of promise, having no hope and without God in the world. So, again, it's saying that without Christ, without Christ, they were aliens from the commonwealth of Israel and strangers from the covenants. So being an alien from Israel, that will make you a foreigner. So who did Christ come for? He came Matthew for the lost sheep. Go back to Matthew 15, 24. Let's go back over to the end. All right. <laughs> Matthew what you got up? 15, 24. Matthew 15. Read what you got. All right. Bring it out. All right. This is the book of 1 Corinthians, chapter 12 and verse 10. To another, the working of miracles. To another, prophecy. To another, discerning of spirits. To another, diverse kinds of tongues. To another, the... No, 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 where you at? No, 12 and 1. This is 1 Corinthians 12 and 1. Now concerning spiritual gifts, brethren... So we're going to say concerning spiritual gifts, right? Which we have. We got a spiritual gift now. We didn't used to have this knowledge. Okay, but we had to go study and study and study, brother. Now read that again from the top. Now concerning spiritual gifts, brethren, I will not have you ignorant. So, brother, we will not have you be ignorant out here, brother. That's right. Read on. Ye know that ye were Gentiles carried away unto these dumb idols. Ye were Gentiles carried away unto the dumb idols, man. Start serving other gods. Read it again. Right. It says, now concerning spiritual gifts, brethren, I will not have you ignorant. Ye know that ye were Gentiles carried away unto these dumb idols, even as ye were led. We were... Listen, man, I don't, I don't, I don't worship no idols, man. Oh, no, we just said that if you, yeah. you celebrate Christmas. Uh, well, at the moment, I plan on to. Yeah, that's, 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 that's worship of idols, brother. <laughs> listen, listen. Hold on. Hold on, brother. Hold on. Let's show you Christmas in the we Bible. Did, like we did, too. We used right. to, let's show Christmas in the Bible. Go back to uh, Jeremiah chapter 10, verse two, uh, 1. Um, what you got, Ot? You got it? Uh, Paul, what he said to those uh, now, to the saints that be in Rome. Okay. 
Uh, let's go to, uh, matter of fact, just grab a uh, Romans 9. Uh, Jeremiah chapter 10. I'm going to show you in the Bible what God said about Christmas, brother. All right? This is the book of Jeremiah chapter 10 and verse 1. Hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Now the whole world. O house of Israel. Oh, the Gentiles. O house of Israel. Everybody. O house of Israel. See, every time we go to a verse, he always talking to the Israelites. But everybody else going to say, oh, he's talking about everybody. She said, I'm speaking to you, O house of Israel. Read on. Thus said the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen. Don't follow these other nations, brother. The Most High God separated us from them. That's right. Read on. And be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them. But the heathens are dismayed. They look up in the sky. They're like, oh, what's going on? Look at the moon. Oh, man, what's going on with the moon? Oh, look at oh, the oh, look at the, look at the planets. Look at the oh, oh, look at the Aquarius. Look at the zodiacs. The Most High, read that again. Thus said the Lord. Learn not the way of the heathen, and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them. The signs of heaven, the stars, suns, and the moon, what's going on? Don't be dismayed at them. Zodiac signs right. Real, yeah. Read on. Zodiac signs. Yeah, that's where they get all that stuff yeah. from. Right. That's the you get the, uh, the, the signs of heaven, you got Aquarius, Leo, Sagittarius. I don't, I don't, you but you they do. Right, they right, do. Right, they, 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 the, the, the other heathen, nations. Heathen, like you said, Jeremiah 10, be not dismayed at them. The other nations. Anybody outside of Israel, yeah, they do. Getting off, uh, no, we're not. Camp. We're going. You're yeah, not you supposed to be Christmas. following after them. Right. Christmas, Christmas was not. You would not find in the Bible where Jesus Christ was celebrating Christmas right. or any Israelite was celebrating Christmas. Exactly. You would not find it. Exactly. That came from these other nations, brother. That's right. What? Show me it. Go ahead. Read on. It's in Matthew. They celebrate Christmas. Show me. It. <laughs> Show me. It. Hey, that's what I got. That's what I got from. Show me. It. Oh, now watch this. Read on, verse Jeremiah. Oh, listen, look. Look, look. Right. This is what I got from it. Look. Right. Can I, can I read it? Go on. Can I, I read it? Show me what it says. Christmas. Right. I want to see right. What it says. Right. Listen. Hold on. Just listen. I got you, brother. Now, the birth of Jesus, the, Master, uh, the Messiah, took right. place in this way. His mother, Mary, had engaged to Joseph, but before they lived together, she was found to be with child from the Holy Spirit. Right. Her husband, Joseph, being a righteous man, unwilling to expose her public disgrace, planned to dismiss her quietly because he she came back all oh, you know kind of big he was like oh that can't be mine she said, Baby, nah, he, 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 it never happened like that but no I, no we got you, he, was gonna go divorce, he was gonna go divorce ahead. her man go ahead, go and, and jesus go god gave her jesus go ahead, gave her a dream man go ahead, I mean, god gave him a dream and said go, go with the woman just go ahead, baby. Convert. Go ahead. Anyway, get to the point. But, but it says but just when he had resolved to do this an angel of the lord appeared to him in a dream and said joseph son of david do not be afraid to take mary as your wife for the child conceived in her is from the Holy Spirit. She will bear a son, and you will name him Jesus, for he will save his people. His people. His people. Okay. His people. Okay. From their sins. From their sins. Okay. Woo! All this took place to fulfill what had been spoken by the Lord through the prophet. Look, the virgin shall conceive and bear a son, and they shall name him Emmanuel, which means God is with us. When Joseph awoke from sleep, he did as the angel of the Lord commanded him. He took her as his wife. But had no relation, uh, mutual relations with her until she had bearing a son, and he named him Jesus. Hallelujah. Now, hold on, hold on. Now, check this out. Hold on, man. Not, listen, get to, get the, to the point. point. This is the point. I'm, I'm telling you. Get to the point. I got you. Don't you like hearing the song? <laughs> yeah, that's right here. This is magical. It's not in the town of King Herod, after Jesus was born in Bethlehem to Judea, wise men from east came to Jerusalem asking, where is the child who had been born of the king of the Jews? For he observed his star at its arising okay right there that is that's the star that it's talking about that's the star that i got from uh, on top of the christmas tree they they hold on, where, no, they made it hold on where's you getting it says it's talking listen. about a star in the sky right, brother right. but all of a sudden no, just listen but what that's a christmas tree over there it's, listen, a, it's listen. no christmas no, tree is no, explained no, go, 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 go ahead go ahead go ahead christmas tree that's you're missing the point go ahead. it says where is the child who has been born the king of the jews for we for we observed his star at his arising and we have come to pay him Himage, when King Hero heard this, he was frightened and all Jerusalem with him and called together all the chief priests and the scribes of the people. And he inquired of them where the Messiah was to be born. They told him, in Bethlehem of Judea, for so it has been written by the prophet. And you, Bethlehem, in the land of Judea, are by no means least among the rulers of Judea, for, for from you shall come a ruler who is shepherd will shepherd my people Israel. Okay? okay. Shepherd my listen. people. Shepherd my people Israel. Man, Show me listen. where it says we should celebrate Christmas. Go ahead. Man, listen. Listen, man. Listen. Y'all got to listen. You're going to listen. 
You gonna listen? Y'all ask some questions. Twenty one questions, but you gotta listen. Let's preach up on one preach. Now this, this, okay, 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 let's okay, let's skip the commercial then. That's right. Let's, let's skip the commercial. Yeah, let's right. skip let's skip the commercial. Okay, right here. This is okay. Yeah. On on entering the house, they saw the child was marrying his mother, and they knelt down and bowed to him into then opening their treasure uh, chest. On they Christmas. okay. They offered him the gifts of gold, frankincense, and, and myrrh. On Christmas. Listen, listen. Now let me show you something. Did you this, know this, that on, that only me, happened at let Christmas? Let me explain what I'm Hold saying. Hold on, I'm, no, I got you. Let me explain what I'm Go saying. Okay, I'll let you talk as a man. Listen. But guess what? You know what? I'm gonna show you something. Let me show you something. Let me explain myself. The Bible says man. do things in decency listen, and order. Listen, guess what, brother? That's right. I got you. This is our floor, and you're trying to dictate it. I'm telling you, brother. Show me where that is Christmas. Listen, they gave listen, gifts, but it didn't say anything listen, about listen, Christmas. Listen, listen, Go ahead. Listen. This right here explains it. When when God when, listen, when Jesus talks, he talks in parables. He talks in riddles. Yeah. He don't. He, he might not say the actual word. He talks in parables where you have to think outside the box. Yeah. When listen, that? listen. It, it, I just told you when the star when the star was signing on Jesus, that was that was his calling. You are chosen. This is who you are. Okay. When the when the when, the, when the, as a matter of fact, the people that came up to Jesus to give him give him gifts and can stuff was it was and all and all and all different people it was three of them can I ask you a question? king hero was gonna kill jesus before he was gonna even be born and and, and mary and them had to dance off on a donkey and ride out on ride out somewhere and then come back later can, on can I ask you a question? the point okay they might have turned christmas into a pagan holiday but the original christmas mean christ is missed man just like okay yeah. just like Easter hold on is brother let me like, show you something like Easter, what did christ Easter. what did christ speak what you mean what, he speak? what language did he speak I believe Jesus Christ speak everything. What? Is or teach? That's not. That's not what he spoke. What did he speak, what did he he speak when he was when he? No. Let's, what did he speak when he walked the earth? When he walked the earth, he spoke the word of God through the Holy Spirit. No. What language? He, Hebrew. 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 You're telling me that Christmas means Christ miss when that is an English bastard word. Right. Brother, that's that right. is not what Christmas means. That's and right. you cannot find. Show me what Christmas means in the Hebrew. Okay. Okay. Well, show me where Jesus Christ only came for certain people. Jesus we just Christ, did. You said it out his mouth. We just showed you Matthew Bro, 15, 24. Is, Shalom, brother. Shalom. Listen, listen, listen. I, no, I'm okay. Not, I'm not. Listen, I'm not. I, I feel where you're coming from. Come on. But listen. Go ahead. Okay. Remember you said the, the woman with the dogs, right? Right. The woman with the. the I, won't, I won't throw it to the dogs. Right. But the woman said, Lord Jesus, even even the dogs eat the crumb from the master's table, and right. he okay. said, you know what? Your faith has made you well. Okay. He forgave the woman and the prostitute too. It's whoever wanted, man. Brother, that, 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 is not, that is not what that is, brother. What does you call it then? When you said he come for the lost sheep of the house of Israel, that's in red letter. That came out of who you call Jesus, Jesus Christ's Christ mouth. mouth. So you're saying that he's lying right now. Right. He said, and when you say unto, that means only. Right. The word unto mean only. That's right. Unto so what? what? Unto, unto the word what? unto yeah. means only. Bring that up, though. What Christ did. He said, I, have, I was only sent for the lost sheep unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. The lost. The prostitutes, the, the, the Israelites people, are the lost, the, man. The, 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 views, the, wicked, the Israelites, the those are the. Sexual. All right, let me show you something. Everybody. Can everybody sin? Can everybody sin? Everybody has sin. Okay, what is sin according everybody to the Bible? Sinning, Hold on. What is sin according to the Bible? It's, it's, it's going against God. It's unrighteous. All right, now, now who? That's unrighteous. Now what? Is, now what? What do you? What is it? Meaning that you break God's laws? Yeah. Who got God's laws? Did everybody on earth get God's laws? Everybody has sinned and for sure the glory of God. Let me get let me get um first John real quick. Right. Did everybody sin? Yeah. And what is sin according to the Bible? Sin is, is uh in, going against God and Going against God, God right? Yes. Now that's breaking God's laws, right? Listen. If you break God's laws, that that's sin, right? You got it? You got first John? Right, come on. Come on up. First four. 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 This is first John chapter three and four. Whosoever committed sin transgress also the law. So whoever commits sin transgress the law. Right. Meaning whoever is sinning, they are breaking the law. Right? right? So I asked you a question, can everybody sin? Because the, only, the way you can sin is when you break the law. Now I'm going to ask you a question. Who got the law to even sin to begin with? What you mean who got the law? Who what the nation law? got the law to even sin to begin with? Because right. sin is transgression of the law. Who was given the law? Who did Moses get a law to? The law is for everybody. To okay, that's, 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 that's cool, that's cool. Okay, Hold on. Let me read it. No, that's right. Deuteronomy chapter 4 and 44. And this is the law which Moses set before the children of Israel. So is that a lie? Is that a lie? This is the law which Moses set before the children of Israel. 
Who's the children of Israel to you? I just showed you on the side, the so-called black, Hispanic, and Native Americans but, are the biblical Israelites. Regardless, but regardless, that's Brother. not everybody. Hey, show them Revelation listen, 21. Listen, uh, is that the Egyptians, the Persians, the, the, right. the, the, the Libyans? What about the Greeks, the Romans? When he said the children of Israel, is that the Greeks, the Romans, the Egyptians, the Persians, the Assyrians? Is it? So they can't repent? Hold on, give me, scripture. give me, hold on, read that verse, matter of fact, give me, um, law, he he, let me get, uh, um, Hebrews the chapter 7, Egyptian, verse 16. The Romans, the Greeks, the What's up, brother? But it just said, it said, and this is the law which Moses set before the children of Israel. That excludes the Egyptians, the Persians, the Assyrians. That scripture excludes them. So you're saying we in America, it's a little way. It excludes them. Like Jeremiah 10, when he read, be not dismayed at the heathen. Because the heathen didn't get the law. He said the children of Israel, don't do what the heathen do, because I gave you a law. He specifically, just like but Moses, gave the law. Go? So he was telling the Israelites, don't go after the way of the heathen. God trees came for a certain nation of people. Stuff, Why is he called the God of Israel? Trees. Matthew 15, 24. Jesus said himself, he didn't come into the law. Sheep but if I showed you in the scripture where the most high, we can, you can try to put them all, but what did God ordain it for them? Did he ordain for him? For his people, right. So, so, so. That's right, and I'm okay, trying to show y'all who really so, is God's chosen people. Okay, he did. You see what I'm saying? So give me one, give me one second. Come on, come here. Come here. Outside of that, what if what if a person is chosen but then don't want to be chosen? What if a person? Yeah, come on, right here. It's not set up like that. Right. It's not set up like that. No, you go when you chosen, bro. You gonna know. You gonna follow that. Like what what caused you to stop and deal with us? Right. Something in your spirit was saying. Spirit gonna bear witness, man. The spirit. We got brothers that look like him, so-called white brothers that come up here, and they be like, "No, my father's." Uh, so-called African American, and they agree with the scripture. Yeah, everybody's mixed up. I'm saying, but, but, but the spirit is going to bear witness. We got people oh. that are Israelites that right. won't even agree with. Now, let me let me ask you a question real quick. What if I showed you this? Do y'all know this is in the Bible? Did you know this is in the Bible, brother? History. Come around here and look at this, brother. Hold on. Look at these pictures, brother. This is literally in the Bible. Did you know that? Did you know it? Literally. Did you know it was in the Bible? And did you know when it's in the Bible it said it was going to happen to God's chosen people? Right. You want me to show you? You ready? Since you want to say that it's everybody, God put a marker on his chosen people so they'll know who they are in the last days. Right. You want to see it? Would you like to know, brother? Let me get Deuteronomy. Let me get Deuteronomy 28, uh, 15. Huh? Right, Bring it up. This is Deuteronomy 1 and 1. Oh, pay attention, y'all. I'm going to show y'all. This is about to blow your mind. These be the words which Moses spake unto all Israel on this side Jordan in the wilderness. So we're speaking in context. This is Moses with the Israelites. Right. Okay? Just remember that. Moses is with the Israelites. Right? Now watch this, brother. Let's go to Deuteronomy 28, verse 1. This is Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 1. And it shall come to pass, if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe and to do all his commandments, which I command thee this day. So it says, it shall come to pass, right? Meaning it shall happen. If you will hearken diligently, sharply, closely, unto the voice of the Lord thy God, right? Read on. That the Lord thy God will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. So now that shows you right there that we are not equal. Because he's telling the people, the Israelites, Moses was with the Israelites in the wilderness, he said, if you are hearkening closely into the voice of the Lord thy God, that in observe and do all the commandments that I'm going to set you on high above all the nations. That's right. Right? Jump down to 15. What you got, huh? Above all the nations. Above all the nations. Above all the nations. That includes the Romans, the Greeks, the Persians. Every, every nation on the earth. 15, huh? Deuteronomy 28 verse 15. But it shall come to pass, if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day, that all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. So he said, if you don't hearken, Deuteronomy chapter 28, 15. 28, 15. You got the 28, 28, 15. Now, just read along, brother. Hold on. Now, read that one more time. But it shall come to pass, if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day, that all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. So he said, if you don't listen to the law, statutes, and the commandments, 
He said that all these curses is a curse, a good thing or a bad thing. He said, if you do not listen, right, into the voice of the Lord thy God to observe, to look, and to do them, then all these curses is going to come upon you and overtake you. So now we're about to show you what the curses is. Let me read down. Got that? Uh, no, nah, start at, uh, start at uh, 16, brother, before you go. I just want to tell y'all I love y'all. Yeah, definitely, brother. I love y'all. Definitely, brother. Just keep encouraging us. Kind, kind. Kind, brother. I got to kiss my brother. Kind. All right. Kind. I love you. I love you. I love you. Kind. All right, now bring that out. This is verse 16 in Deuteronomy 28. Hello. Curse shalt thou be in the city. Bob, I'll give you a flyer, brother. What, what, what is the job? About the Bible. You can do the Bible? That's right. That's right. See, brothers is waking up, man. That's brothers is waking up, man. Get this brother a flyer, man. We are the sons of Jacob, the Hebrew Israelites of the Bible, man. God's chosen people, according to the bloodline. See, brothers is waking up, man. Read that for us, man. Curse shalt thou be in the city, and curse shalt thou be in the field. So would you say us as a people, the so-called black, Hispanic, and Native Americans, will we be cursed in these cities? Are we cursed in these cities? I'm dealing with you. Are you telling me we ain't the, we on, on, on the bottom of the bottom? We ain't on the ghettos. Think about the mental huh? Think about where we, we ain't on. We, we ain't on. Hold on. We ain't, we ain't on food stamps. Huh? Well, I ain't got no food stamps. I'm just saying, our people as a nation, though, we ain't at the bottom. Look, man, we go. Are we at the bottom? The hey, that's right. So we're just telling you right now, we started from the bottom. So we at the bottom, brother. If we starting from somewhere, that means we already there. So read that again. <laughs> Curse shall that be in the city. And curse shalt thou be in the field. Now look on these signs. You see these people, our ancestors working in the fields? Was that a blessing or a curse? Man, look, I don't know, torture. That's a good thing or a bad thing? Because a blessing is a good thing and a curse is a bad yeah, thing. Yeah, that's bad. I, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's, so he says, curse shalt thou be in the city. That's what I'm about to show you that it's prophesied. It says, curse shalt thou be in the city, right? And we in the city and we cursed in the city. And curse shalt thou be in the field, right? Now read on. Curse shall be thy basket in thy store. When we go to the store, man, we can't even buy our food because we ain't even got enough money to pay for it. We got to worry about what we're going to pay for it. We got to put stuff back. Read on. Curse shall be the fruit of thy body and the fruit of thy land. So your children, man, and your land going to be cursed. We got another people over there in our land to this day. Okay? We're not in our original land. We were brought over here on slave cargo ship. Right. You in the land of your captivity. You cursed in this country, man. Pull your pants up, clown. Read. The increase of thy kind, and your children, and the flocks of thy sheep. Cursed shalt thou be when thou comest in. You're going to be cursed when you come in this world, in this country. Right? Read on. And cursed shalt thou be when thou goest out. You're going to be cursed when you go out. That's a bad thing. Read on. The Lord shall send upon thee cursings, vexations, and rebuke. And the Lord shall do what? Send upon thee cursings, vexations, and rebuke in all that thou settest thy hand unto for to do. Man, you're gonna you're gonna have a hard time coming up in this world, in this country, man. Every day you set your hand on to do, man, you're not gonna come up. You haven't came up yet. Your forefathers never passed you down no inheritance. We on the bottom. Let me get to 32. Uh -huh. you got you got it? Yeah. Bring it up. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people. What? Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people. So was our sons and daughters given unto another people? Yeah. And who was those people? Israelites. No. Who who were we given to? Man, you know who we give to. I'm asking you, brother. Well, you know. Were they our friends or were they our enemies? Were they our friends or our enemies? That man said the enemy. That's right. Man. I'm just showing you prophecy, brother. I'm just showing you prophecy. You gotta wake up. Because we've been lied to. That's right. Told the people that same the ones that killed our ancestors as our friends and we equal to them now. Right. Murderers, robbers, rapists, pillagers. No, we're not equal to them, brother. Right. The most high God said we were above them. We done? Read that again from the top. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people, and thine eyes shall look and fail with longing for them all the day long. Our sons and daughters shall be given into another people, slavery. Right? Auction block. Right? And our eyes shall fail, cry, for longing for them all day long. What? Because we was watching our kids be sold off. We were crying. They're going into another plantation over there somewhere else. This will happen to our people. Read on. And there shall be no might in thine hand. 
They were crying and failing and longing all day because their kids were being sold to another nation and they had no might in their hand to stop it. Nobody stopped this. Look at it, it's history. You said it yourself. It happened. We didn't stop it. We don't. This is Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 33. The fruit of thy land and all thy labor shall a nation which thou knowest not eat up. We was in the cotton fields. We was in the sugar cane fields. And another nation ate up all our labor. We had to bring it to master. And master would take it to the factories and make millions off of us in these fields from sun up. Look at that, brother. Look at them women. They end up from sun up to sundown. Hadn't got thorns on it. You know what? They out there with they bare hands, picking cotton, bleeding to death. From sun up to sundown, brother. This is prophecy. Read on. So that it's like it. So can I have something? Before you get to start, no, hey, go, go ahead. ahead. What about everybody that's mixed up? Then what? Well, it's um, not that everybody's not mixed up. What if, listen, what, I listen. Got halfway go to heaven? Listen, no, you're not. Why? This is the second time we heard that. This, right, right, right. <laughs> no, you are what your father is. Time. You see what I'm saying? Judah. Right. Your father is Judah. If your mama white, then you still Judah, brother. Right. You are, your your well, daddy put your daddy put the seed in your mama, right. just so you could bring come out and come out. You see what I'm saying? But you was in your daddy's nutsack swimming around. He told me that. He told me that. Right. So you are already an entity. You are already, you just had to bring forth into this world. The only way you could come forth into this world was to be planted into a woman. So you can grow. And she can give birth to you. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You are what your father is. There's no, no such thing as being mixed. Right. You see what I'm saying? So, uh, I just, look, man, I just think he's crazy. I know you, I know that's, that's what you were taught, brother. You were taught that. Taught what? That's, that's that what Jesus Christ loved everybody. That's not what the scripture says. Let me show you something. You want me to show you why? Let me show you where, where, you, where you're uh, mistaken. You think God loves everybody, right? Yeah. What if I showed you in the Bible that God don't love everybody uh, uh, word for word? You're going to show me the new, you're... I'm going to show you that God don't love everybody. Right. You want me to show you? Who does he hate? Ooh. I'm about to show you. Let me go, let me go to uh, Romans chapter 9 verse chapter 13. 9, 13. And 8 too. 8 and 13. So you know. Yeah. You know he hates, man. Read it. Read it for him. This is the book of Romans, chapter 9. And sorry. 13. 13. As it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. I thought God loved everybody. Read it again. As it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. Say as it is written, because it's in Malachi too. Right. right. Bring it, bring it out, huh? Bring it out. Let me bring this out for you. Bring, bring it out. The book of Psalms, chapter 5 and verse 5. The foolish shall not stand in thy sight. Thou hatest all workers of iniquity. All workers. The ones that are doing it. That's right. America. Workers of iniquity. He hates these people, right. man. So you know they say God don't hate the people. He just hates the sin. Well, this is Psalm 5 and 5. He said he hates the workers of iniquity. Meaning the workers of sin. Transgression of the law. Transgression of the law, brother. We've been taught wrong. So I'm going to ask you a question. What does grace mean to you? Grace means that you have a time period to get right. Right. If I asked you, if you wanted to pay your bill, your light bill, right? Yeah. You call the light company, you say, hey, I can't pay my, my bill till the 19th, right? They say, all right, we're going to put you on this grace period. Do they mean that you can't pay it? Right. I mean that you, you just forget about it and don't pay it? No, that's a time for you to get right, get that money collected together, and then go get, do what's right. That's and right. pay it up. And now it's get right time. And it's get that's right time right. right now. And then once you get to pay, you're like, whoo. Yes. Yeah. And that's what we in. We getting heaven, right, bro. brother. We getting right. When, come, when heaven come down, bro, our riches is going to be here. We're going to be like... That's right. So that's the patience of the the, uh, the patience and the faith of the saints. That we endure these tough times and these trials, man. That's right, brother. That's right. Let me get uh, with, Jesus, Lord. Well, he's he's not the most high, but he is a Lord. He is Lord. You believe the Son of God? Right. I believe he's the only begotten Son. We believe just like you. Yeah, we believe in the Holy Spirit. Yes. But they're not one. They're not, not one. Not they all different, now, he but they just all said triune. I heard right. That. They're, they're, they're all working as one. Well, right. we say, I, Hold on, they're all working as one. He said, "Remember when um, Jesus Christ said that I do the will of the Father?" Right. 
that just shows you right there that he, he would have said, I'll do the will of myself. Right. Who's he doing the will of? He's doing the will of his father. Right. That means that they're all not one, but they're on one accord. Right. He don't do what he want to do. He's following what the father told right. him to do. Okay, they just say that. Right. right. Because they asked him who, who was good, and he said, I'm not good. He's called the father good. He says, I'm good, good, but one. And that's the father in heaven. Oh, so now you see that. Well, who's the one? The father. Right. That's what I'm trying to show you, brother. It is no triune. This is no uh, trinity. Okay. And John, though, in this age, the father, son of one. Right, that's they're, they're on one accord. Right. They're on one accord. They're on one accord. He doesn't do nothing but what the Father the says. One most high God, and then you got the Son of God. You got the Godhead. You got the, the Spirit. The the Spirit. Holy, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Right. Yeah, and then let me get uh, on First one, Timothy. John, on let me get First Timothy, please. Father, right. I think it's First Timothy. Oh, get, you can bring the Malachi out first. Uh, first Timothy, where it says uh, uh, the order of uh, man, woman, and okay. it said First Timothy, I believe, uh, two. two. Yeah, yeah, two. Uh, you got that Malachi? Sorry. This is Malachi one. It says, the burden of the word of the Lord to Israel by Malachi. I have loved you, said the Lord. Yet ye say, wherein hast thou loved us? Was not Esau Jacob's brother? So Esau was Jacob's brother, right? Right, read on. Said the Lord, yet I loved Jacob and I hated Esau and laid his, his mountains and his heritage waste for the dragons of the wilderness. That's why they say he come from the Caucasus Mountains. That's right. where the most I put them. Right. So they, 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 the most high hate him, man. What do you hate him for? Be because yeah, they, he's, he's, uh, but not only that, he sold his birthright. Yeah. Why he said it? Because he was, he was he's hungry. hungry. Yeah, he didn't care about it. Right. Wanted some uncooked meat. Right. Yeah. And the so-called, the biblical, yet. the biblical nationality of Esau that he hate is the so-called white race, man. Yeah. Real talk, they not even white. What color is he right there? Look at his shirt. What color is he? They red. I can show you that in the Bible, too. Get Genesis 25 and 23. What you got up? Got it, bro. Yeah, that's one of the most Jesus Christ down on the cross. He says, yeah, he's down on the cross. It's all from a tree. Yeah, just, uh, can you search it up? Just search it up. Uh, uh, one, two, though. Christ that don't mean the word. No, no, he's saying. I mean, don't nobody want to die, but. All right, grab Genesis. Right? This is the book of Genesis, chapter 25 and 23. And the Lord said unto her, Two nations are in thy womb, and two manner of people shall be separated from thy bowels. So two manner of people about to be separated from her womb. All right, read on. And the one people shall be stronger than the other people. We're stronger than them, man. Right. Always been. Look at Mike Tyson. Look at Michael Jackson. Look at Muhammad Ali. You know what I'm saying? We look at uh, 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 Usain Bolt. Okay. Right. Look at look at uh, 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 Castillo. Castello. Right. All these brothers, man. Uh, Oscar De La Hoya. All these brothers is great men on the earth, and they use the Israelites, man, to uh, entertain them. All right. Watch this. Read. And the elder shall serve the younger. You saw came out first. What? Read up. And when her days were to be delivered, were fulfilled, behold, there were twins in her womb. And the first came out red all over like a hairy garment. Look at him. Look, Look at him, bro. Look, bro. Yeah. Look at his chest. Can you like this for me real quick? Look at that Like a hairy garment. Like, it says red. Red and hairy like a hairy garment. And they called his name Esau. So his biblical, let me ask you a question. What's the nationality of your father? See? He's an he's a, he's a, he's a Edomite, man. He said Italian and Indian. That's right. The Italians, they Edomites, man. Yeah. I, I, right? I, so, I, I think the, 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 ain't, the original white people ain't they blue eyes and, and red hair and blonde hair. Look at his eyes, man. Because he got to be cut with something. Ain't he, nobody else. It ain't no, ain't he's, no two he's, white people that he's, are the he's, same. He, he, listen, they from the nation of Israel, brother. And just All like, of them is, yeah. Yeah, just, just like we got multiple tribes in the Israelites, they got multiple nations in the uh, Edomites. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say, man. That's what I'm trying to show you. So everybody is not God's people, brother. Right. That's the whole point. He, oh, hold on. I get what you saying. He's you saying like, look, there's twelve tribes on ours. Yeah. And then for the, the white the race, there's there's many tribes for them too. Yeah. So third, we're not the same. Though. Right. We're not the same, brother. He divided the nations. Two manner of people. Two manner yeah. of people shall be separated. They were separated from us. They were twin brothers. They were we were they were our twin brothers, brother, in biblical times. But the Most High separated us. That's why they, they. That's why the so-called white race have a perpetual hatred for the so-called black, Hispanic, and Native American to this day. 
Okay, I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna throw this out here. Right. Let me grab. Uh, okay. Grab, grab uh, Hebrew chapter seven verse uh, seventeen. Since we bring that up. Sixteen. Just like that. Just like that. War. The war war two and all that. The what? The war war two. Listen. Right. Like the, like there's good people and there's bad people. You got righteous people and you got wicked people. Right. Now I'm gonna just say this. The bloodline that I read said that the inheritance we're adopted into the body of Christ. So I took it as if. <laughs> Say you got, you know how you, they used to say the niggas and the Jews. Yeah, you know how you used to say the niggas and the Jews. Okay, this this is my point. There's good people and there's bad people. You know what you're saying is right. I got y'all listening. What you saying is right? Hey, check this out. What do you mean? Yeah, you know, you I'm glad you bring that up. I'm glad you bring that up. Yeah, right. But so, so ain't there two? It ain't that good, a bad, and a bad, and the good. Well, remember those Jews. I mean, just, just, but it's the spirit of God, though, ain't it? Well, we go by the spirit. That will let us know today who's really of the nation of Israel. It deals with nations, brother. Jeremiah went into slavery. Right, Daniel went into slavery. They were good people. You see what I'm saying? That's what I'm. That's what I'm they were good people. They went into slavery. Yeah, it just so happens that they just happen to be predominantly no, no, so-called no. Negro. That's just the way it turned out. Okay. You see what I'm saying? I hear so we got people that have mixed down the line that may look like this guy. The guy sitting by the tree. Right. But if their spirit is saying, hey, I know about this. I agree. This is wrong. Hey, and then they come with scriptures and back it up. The spirit is drained with okay. it. Okay, I agree with that, bro. But majority as a nation of people, we see how these they ain't, they ain't trying to rock with us like that. See what I'm saying? As a nation of people, they ain't trying to rock with us like that. If we bring up this, if we bring this, this they tell you to forget about it. it. It's, it's in the past. They don't want to talk about it. Right. In the past. Right. right. They don't want to hear none of this, man. Yeah. And I want to hear what their ancestors did to what God showed the people, man. I'm going to show you that. You think you think salvation for everybody, right? Watch this. Let's see what the Bible says. Let's see what the Bible says. Read that out. No, hold on. Hold on. Let me just stop right there. Salvation. It's for the Gentiles and it went on, not for the Israelites. That's right. And then it went on and said, now from now on, uh, salvation is also for the We, we just showed you who the, the, the Israelites were called Gentiles in the flesh because they went from, they became aliens and strangers from the commonwealth of Israel being without Christ. So they became strangers and Gentiles, brother. Right. Now grab the adoption, Maccabees, brother. The adoption belongs to Israel. Maccabees, uh, chapter, uh, that's right. Got that Romans 9? Come on, this is the book of Hebrews, chapters 12 and 16. You think everybody can read? Hold on, let's read it together. Okay. Let me read it together. Hebrews, chapter 12, verse 16. Hey, Salaki. Hey, 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 Salaki. Okay. Hey, hey, brother, can you scoot over and can you brother scoot up so we can get Okay. You said Israel what? All right, Hebrews, chapters 12 and 16. Hebrews 12, 16. He's talking about Esau, bro. Remember we just read about when Esau is. Hebrew. Hebrew what? Okay, Hebrew. You know? This is the book of Hebrews, chapter 12 and verse 16. Lest there be any fornicator or profane person as Esau. See, they fornicate and they profane, man. They do all type of madness in the world, man. Right. Sleeping with little children, sleeping right. with their cousins, right. raping them, all, all, that, all that madness, man. Yeah, yeah, right. They they say yeah, a, a, a girl a girl could be a boy now, right. a boy could be a girl, or you could be neutral. You ain't even you could just you could be anything. You could be an alien now. They say hey, we ain't even gonna tell the kid oh, what he is and what his gender until he get like four or five years old. We gonna let him pick. Right. Well, you just going against God. Right. God said that was a woman. God, a, a, boy, a boy. God said that was a girl. Right. But now man is going against that and saying hey, they could be whatever they want to. Let them pick. Right. They're fornicators, man. They're uh, profane. Yeah, I, I, yeah, right. Read that again. Yeah, I put yeah, the top. Yeah, I, Huh, lest there be any fornicator or profane person as Esau, who for one morsel of meat sold his birthright. We sold his birthright, brother. Read right on. For ye know how that afterward, when he have inherited the blessing, he was rejected. He was rejected, brother. Right. Okay. Watch this. For he found no place of repentance. Though he sought it carefully with tears. Found no place for repentance. Repentance ain't for them, man. Right. They can't repent. Right. They sold their birthright. Who's they? The white race. Right. Esau. Esau. Jacob got the birthright. The, the Bible's telling you right the now. The Bible's telling you. Jacob got the birthright.